It's Saturday in Milan and that means it is market day. So the market to visit is Mercato Forche where you will find everything from fresh fruits and cheeses and meats to textiles. We are in Milan after all. Look at that jar of anchovies. I would take that whole thing home. Oh, wow. Mm. They're beautiful mushrooms. Look at these. These golden, almost portobello mushrooms. The smell of cheese just pulls me into this stand here. There is nothing like this back home. And I love how you can be in the market and have clothing on one side and vegetables on another, and then a cheese stand like this. Absolutely an incredible spot. Prego, prego, prego! Ayo! This is already one of my favorite stands at the market because it has some of my favorites. Meat, 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 all kinds of cured meat, sausages, and then of course cheese. And one of my favorite cheeses that I've come across is that gorgonzola from Bergamo. It is creamy, it is salty, it is sweet, it is la dolce vita. Mm, so good. Oh, it's sweet. When you come to Mercato Foche, you must come to Nostrano, this incredible salami and formaggio cheese stand that has the best selection and the best hospitality. Do not miss this stand. Italia <gasps> 1. Ruffle, tartufa? Wow. Gosh, I wish I could take this home to America. Il Casale d'Arcisa has truffles. Incredible truffles. And it's worth the sniff, which they're more than happy to help you with. Molto bono or molto bene? Molto, molto buono. Ottimo. Ottimo, molto buono. Grazie. <laughs> I'm on Via Monte Napoliane and this is the place to come for all of the luxury shopping you could possibly ever want to do in Milan.
if you're looking for an extra special rooftop bar with a view and killer cocktails, then you need to come to Palazzo Mettiati and Latitude Bar for a million dollar view. And my poison tonight is the Cosmopolitan, but a slight twist because it's served with almost an Italian version of the cranberry garnish, which has a flavor somewhere between a traditional cranberry and a blueberry. And this drink is the perfect balance between sweet and sour. If you're looking for nightlife, then the place to go in Milan is Navili. This canal district is lined with cafes and bars and is the center of nightlife in Milan. I am at Spritz Navili this evening for Aperitivo, and I have to tell you, I'm super excited because this atmosphere is electric, and it's unlike anything I've ever done before, and it's definitely um, something you need to know how to do here in Milan, starting with uh, writing your order down and giving it to the waiter. So they hand you the notepad and the pen, and then you write down your order, give it to them, and then they come back with your food and drink, which is pretty cool. And the interesting thing is that we were looking for maybe a place where we could sit down and have a bowl of pasta or something like that, but everyone is sitting from cafe to cafe having their little plates of the appetizers. So it's actually buffet style inside. So you'll, when you come to the Navili area, you'll actually see that there are lines of people inside the restaurant going through a buffet, picking out their food on a little plastic plate, and then sitting outside, looking at the canal, having fun, talking with their friends, and having the Milano life. Buffet? Yes. Wow. Open buffet. Wow, very nice. Open buffet. <laughs> this is incredible. When you come here to Spritz, you'll find the most beautiful buffet. Grab a plate, take your appetite, and manja. All you can eat, meat and deliciousness. Even it's Thanksgiving in Milan, they even have a turkey. Risotto, tarali, some kind of a, looks like lasagna, olives, oh wow, olive uh, focaccia. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Okay, so this is awesome for 22 euros, two drinks and buffet, all you can eat buffet. And let's start with the drinks. So this is a Fiero Spritz, which is something I've never had before, but it looks uh, beautiful red in color. I'm guessing it might be Campari or Vermouth, I'm not sure, or both. I'm not familiar with what this is, but it's called Fiero and it's really, really good. It's almost, um, like a sweet and tart cherry. Twist on the spritz. And then of course the classic Aperol spritz, which is the Italian cocktail here in the Lombardy region. And uh, served with a green olive and a slice of orange. And you all know me, it's one of my favorites. Look at this plate. Can you believe this? All you can eat, mortadella, salami. I mean, they have the focaccia with the green olives, sausage and kraut and potatoes and pasta. This is understandably the place to hang out when you come to Milan on a Friday night or any night. Nevili, don't miss it.